Hey everyone, it's Simplicity and welcome back to a new video. Today we have another part of Stella Do. So quickly, I'm just going to go ahead and put everything up in the chest that we already have. I believe I can go ahead and sell the winter loot, or at least one of them, because I don't need both. So let's go ahead and just do that. I am filming this right after I filmed the last part, so... We'll see how this goes, but I was in the mood to play for just a little bit longer today, so I was like, you know what, why not? But let's go ahead, we will water the cauliflower over here. I want to see if we are able to go ahead and get one of the, like, big crops is kind of what I'm after. Let me go ahead and water these. And then I want this. Oh. Well, I don't know if the mix seeds were necessarily worth it. But let's just go ahead, we will pluck all of these parsnips here to at least give us a little bit of some extra money. My inventory's full, so that must be a different quality than what I can hold, but that's okay. Okay, so it's just like this one random one. Shipping bin, we'll go ahead and throw these in here. And then see if I can pick this one up, we'll put you in there too. Okay, so we at least, you know, we're making decent money, I think. Should be alright. And we now have an upgraded axe, which means that I can go ahead and hit these stumps. And we can get some hardwood out of it, which will help us for one of the bundles. So I kind of want to focus on that, but I'm also going to go ahead and put down the crab pots. I need some bait. Um, okay, we grab some bait, we'll put these in here. And then we'll come back and check that tomorrow. But not too bad. I'm just going to kind of run around and see if we can gather some hardwood. Because I would love to be able to complete the, is it the construction bundle, I think. And having that done before even finishing spring, like, I feel like that's pretty good to me. Um, I don't know. I don't normally, like, pay attention to my records for things. But how many? Okay. I think I need ten, right? Um... Yes, okay. So, we're almost there. We'll be able to get that here pretty quickly. I'm gonna see if I can get rid of this tree, I guess. Ooh! We just got a mystery box from that. Now, I'm intrigued to see what's in it, but I'm gonna go ahead and hit this giant stump. Now, I don't believe I can hit the logs. I think that's the one thing I'm not able to go ahead and do. Uh, can I... Maybe get rid of this put some of this up okay so now we have that mystery box so we can go ahead and take that over to clint at some point but now we need to go ahead and find i think it's one more stump so let's just go ahead the flower dance has begun in the forest i forgot that it was the flower dance okay well i'm gonna come up here to get this stump quickly so that i at least have all of the hardwood that i need perfect Plant that mahogany seed over here, and then we'll run up here, we'll check on the chickens, we'll pet them, say hey, and then we'll go ahead and head to the flower dance, possibly. But, you know, I want to make sure we are getting everything done that we need to get done for the farm today. So, let's go ahead and sell the eggs. We have a lot of stuff to donate for the museum. Okay, let me just put this up here for now, because I can't plant them since we need spring and i don't have enough time left in spring right now to be able to you know actually do anything with the rice so that's my own fault because i've had those for a while but we're gonna go ahead and we'll head down here and head over to the flower festival now it's not going to be the most exciting festival this year because i don't have a high enough heart level to be able to dance with anyone so it's gonna be a little bit sad and boring I could have gotten it done um, if I had paid more attention to like gifting Haley. Absolutely could have gotten it done. All right, let's go ahead and we'll just run around. I'm gonna talk to everybody because it helps with my relationships. Clint wants to know if Emily would dance. Well, I mean, you could ask her. Okay, I can't get out from there. We'll come over here and say hi to Linus, and then Money, and I'm still single. Well, I mean, you know, Marlon is standing right there, and he is clearly interested. 
practicing my dance moves flower queen so like see if i go ahead and ask Kaylee, i get you now and she's the one that i have the highest heart level with so we are not going to be able to dance with anybody this year but that's okay we're just gonna go ahead and just chat with everybody see if we can you know increase heart levels a little bit and it's just it's nice being able just to kind of talk to everybody i know i'm not leading out the dialogue but it kind of gets a little bit repetitive quick. So let's just go ahead and finish chatting with everybody. Am I going to be dancing? No, Jody, I'm not. Um, okay. Did I get everybody other than Pierre? Because I don't believe I can. He does sell some stuff in here. Uh, he's got a recipe, which I'm kind of intrigued, but I kind of want the real cool more, I think. Um, I want to go for the little curl. I would love the tub of flowers recipe, but I'm going to go with the little curl. So let's just go ahead. We'll head up here and talk to Lewis and we can go ahead and get the dance started. Well, we just awkwardly stand on the sidelines because we have nobody to dance with. All right. So yeah, you kind of just kind of watch them dance. We just awkwardly kind of stand there a little bit, but you know, that's all right. Okay. I feel like it's such like a weird kind of like dance. I don't know. Like I know a lot of people enjoy it and I enjoy it whenever I have somebody to dance with because it helps with heart levels. But, like, the first year, I'm kind of like, eh, that was fun. Time to go home. Okay. Well, that was it for the flower dance of the year. I don't believe there's anything I necessarily need to do. But I might. I'm going to drink this coffee. We're going to go for a jog over to the community center. Um... I also want to go ahead and make an island bar quick. So let me just get those in there. I should have done that earlier, but I wasn't thinking about it. Because I do want to upgrade my axe again. So let's just go ahead and run over to the community center. See if we can get the hardwood put in there before I accidentally use it. For some sort of like, who knows, crafting recipe. Kind of anything of that sort. So let's just go ahead and get in here. I love having a glow ring. Like this is such a huge difference for me. Okay, let's come down here, I believe it is. And we will go ahead and place the hardwood in here. There we go, bundle complete. And we got a charcoal kiln. Okay. Nowhere close there. I can get some stuff for that. That we're almost in. Not that bad. Not bad, not bad. I feel like the foraging ones are, you know, typically easier. But let's just go ahead. Um, I'm just double checking to make sure there's not anything I need to donate. Okay. We appear to be safe. So let's just go ahead, we will run home, and that will be the end of today. Alright, run, run, run. Thankfully this coffee has not worn off yet. Considering I just went the long way around from the community center. But we should be able to get home in time. We didn't use up a whole lot of energy today either, which is nice. How much time do you have left? 50 minutes. Okay, I'm kind of tempted to just stand here and wait. I also want to put down this little crow. So maybe we'll put you... Like here, I guess. I feel like that's an okay spot. Uh, just so it's not taking up any space. And... Let's see. Grab some water for the morning. At least I can be a little bit productive that way, even though it's yelling at me that it's being, you know, getting late. But I just want... There we go. Perfect. Let me grab these so I can put more in. 
and then we'll just go ahead and head off to bed because then those will be ready in the morning and I don't have to worry about it, but there we go. We made some decent money today, all because of the parsnips, but let's go ahead and move on. So we're going to officially be on day 25, which is wild to think of. All right. So the bookseller is in town today. We do not have the money for that, I don't believe. Uh, good humor. Perfect. We love a good humor day. But there we go. So the iron is now ready. We got 500 from dad. So at least, you know, we did just get some extra money. And then we'll go ahead and water that. Okay. I'm just going to keep watering these cauliflower. I just, I want to know if I can get a large crop. Because I have had some before, just not this early in the game, so I'm curious to see if I can do it. Now, my inventory is full, so I'm not able to go ahead and grab that. But let's go ahead and we will put some stuff away into the junk chest, maybe. Um, okay, I'm going to grab some of this tree stuff, I think. Because I might be able to go ahead and plant them. Because that would give us some extra trees to be able to cut down for wood. So I'm kind of tempted. I don't have enough iron to go ahead and make another iron bar. So I'm not doing that. And then I'll go ahead and place down the charcoal kiln to get that out of the inventory. We can come and grab the green bean and then we can sell that. Did not mean to click on the junk chest. There we go. And... Okay, let's come up here and take care of the chickens just before I forget to do that. Now, I have kind of messed myself up because I did not go ahead and grab the seeds for the parsnips. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to get another harvest out unless I have a bunch of speed grow. That's about the only way. So let's just go ahead. We'll sell these eggs as well because I don't need them currently. And... I kind of want to put this painting up, maybe, just to kind of get it out of the inventory. But let me see if I can enter the house and find a spot for this. There's not a whole lot of room. I feel like I could fit that, like, here. You can't see it, but at least, you know, it gets rid of something out of our inventory. And then let's just go ahead and we'll head over towards the town, I think. We'll see what we can get up to. Alright, it's not even 8 o'clock in game, which means that we have a bunch of things that we could possibly get done today. Um, I did not mean to look at that. In need of a flounder for 300 gold. I feel like I can do that. Uh, we just got a cave carrot. Nothing out of there. What about here? Nothing. Well, that was disappointing. But I think we're going to come over here and go to Clint's, see what's inside the mystery box that we have. I also need to go to the library and donate a bunch of stuff. So maybe we will also go ahead and do that now before I forget to. So let's go ahead and donate to the museum. So as you can see, we have a bunch of stuff that we can go ahead and do. So I'm going to start with the schools. I'm going to put these down here. Um, we've got the frozen teal that I'm going to put there. And then we've got the computer that I don't remember the name of. Let's put that over here. Okay, so we have a new reward out of that, which happens to be another painting. Which I don't know if I'm going to have any space for, but we can try. And then I'm going to have to remind myself to come back and get those seeds for the summer. You are not open yet, so I'm just going to wait for 9 o'clock because I want to see what's inside the mystery box. We may also have some geodes. I think we have a frozen one for sure. So we'll have to see what's in it so that we can possibly donate that to the museum as well. Okay, let's start with the mystery box. A warp totem for the farm's not exciting. We have some iron. And we have some more iron. Honestly, I'm not mad about that. We needed that anyways, so I'm okay with that. And then I already checked the trash can for there. 
So I need to get a flounder for Carolyn. I need to make that other island bar back at the farm. So that I can potentially upgrade my axe again whenever I have the money. Um, I don't know. There's a few different things I can do, but what is this? A stone. Okay. I'll take it, I guess, but let's just go ahead and we will fish. See if we can get the flounder for Caroline. And I don't know. We'll just see what we can do. I also do want to increase my fishing skill a lot. So we'll see how that goes. The things I do because I want to see if there's anything good in a chest. Alright, so we have a saladine and some bait. That reminds me I need to check that spot at the farm. Let me go ahead and sell the saladine. And let's go ahead and take a look here. Just add some stuff up. Perfect. At least clear out some inventory space. And then we're just going to go ahead and continue fishing. See what we can, hopefully, see if we can catch the flounder. I don't remember if I've even caught one yet. I don't know. I know I haven't caught the legend, but that's because I know I can't currently catch that. I need a higher skill for that. So I'm not even going to attempt it. The only way I'd be able to catch it this early, I think, is if I added the fishing mod. And I know I can catch it on my own because I've done it. So we got another sardine. Um, I don't know. We're just going to hang out. We're going to fish. Hope that we, you know, potentially level up that skill. I would love to be able to do that. Because I want a better fishing rod. And I don't want to go ahead and purchase the, is it the fiberglass rod? Like, I'd rather just go straight to the Iridium one. So, we'll see how that goes. But let's just go ahead and fish away. Okay, so we have an anchovy. Sardines and anchovies. Neither are the fish that we need. But at least it's a little bit of money. I guess I can't complain all too much. So, let's just see. I'm pretty sure the flounder is an all-day fish. I should have probably looked that up before we came over here and went fishing, but I'm pretty sure it's an all-day fish. Alright. We're getting a lot of Joja Cola today. Which, like, I'm not mad about it, but I don't use it as often because it wears off so fast. Okay. Let's just go ahead and see if we can catch this fish here, too. Okay, so that's another sardine. Oh, that was fairly quick. What's in here? Okay, I want this chest, but I kind of don't want to, like... Okay, well, that was a hailing. So, nothing all too exciting. There is a hawk outside of my window right now, and I am getting distracted by it because it's flying around in circles. This is not the time for there to be a hawk that is, like, catching my attention. And I only noticed it because it's flying in circles. Okay, let me see if I can catch this fish here, too. Perfect. Okay, well, that was another hailing. Um, was I wrong about the flounder being an all-day fish? Or am I just not having good luck? Okay. Come on, flounder. I want the 300 gold out of you. I don't even know how much the flounder actually sells for. But I like being able to kind of help them out, too, because I think that helps with heart levels. Okay, well, that's another hailing. And I have officially run out of space in my inventory. Um. Okay, I'm just gonna trash the fish, I guess. And then we'll run into Willy and go ahead and sell. Okay, you can take all of these. I do not need them. And then we'll run back out here and continue fishing. 
But that's kind of one reason I like fishing at the beach is I can run in and get the money instantly. I know it doesn't count towards like... Actually, I don't think that matters when it comes to the fish. Pretty sure you don't actually have to ship the fish in the shipping bin. I don't fully remember. But I just want to see if we can get this flounder. That's all I'm after right now is just a little flounder. Okay, well that's another herring. The herrings are very easy to catch. Which is so weird to me because I've, I always thought herrings were worth more than what they are. They're not that great of a fish, but seaweed is also not that great. Alright, well we are just going to keep on fishing. Fishing. The living hat has not seemed to bring us any luck. Not that it's supposed to. But I felt pretty lucky getting it because I don't know anybody else that has ever had it. But, I don't know. I feel like we have kind of wasted this entire day just, you know, fishing. But I'm also not, like, mad at it by any means. That's some extra money. Gives us time to see if we can get the skill up. We got a sardine. Okay. Well, oh. Oh. This one's on the move a little bit. Okay. Oh. Well, that was just another study, and I thought maybe it was something, you know, a little bit more exciting, just because it moved around a little bit more. But, I don't know, we might actually not be able to get this flounder today. Unless it's just out here playing tricks, but it does not seem to want to come around for some reason. Okay, let's just wait. Oh, there we go, we got a hit. And this one's immediately moving its way up. Now you've become a little bit more stagnant, but... Oh, there we go. Okay, we finally got the flounder. I'm gonna hop in here. We're going to sell the other fish to Willy. Do not sell the flounder. And it's a gold quality. I'm just gonna get rid of the seaweed. But we, uh, we can now go ahead and take a visit over to Caroline. And I'm gonna go ahead and drink my coffee. Just so I can get over to Caroline a little bit faster. Because I believe Pierre's closes pretty quickly unless you were already like in the building. So, can I layer these maybe? I don't know if that made me any faster or not. I thought you could layer them, but I'm not like 100% sure. Can we? Okay, cool. It's finally Lisa. Hi. I'm not entirely here for you. I could give you some things, but how do I take my chances? How much speed go do I have? Um. Okay. I'm gonna buy enough that I can cover them with speed go. Alright, so I'm gonna have to plant those like as soon as I get home. Is Caroline here by any chance? Does not appear to be either here, no. She's not in her bedroom, neither is Abigail, although she is. Hi, Elliot. Am I well? Yeah, I'm alright. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and give you the flounder you wanted. Uh, let's see, here's what I owe you. Perfect, we can go ahead and take that money. And we can now go ahead and head back to the farm because I need to plant those parsnips and the speed grow as soon as I possibly can. I don't even know if I'm giving myself enough time to get them done. I'm going to assume that I can probably have them done by the end of the season by using speed grow, but I don't 100% know. Okay. Parsnips, speed grow. Let's see. I'm just going to fix this up and then we're going to go ahead and place it down my speed glow over here. Because I would rather place these down first. Alrighty. And then we'll go ahead and put down the parsnips. I kind of have to hope that they plant where I want them to plant and not somewhere else, which is a little bit scary. But let's just go ahead and do this. And then we need to go ahead and water all of them. So we'll do that quickly too. Okay. But I think 
I have a feeling we should be okay with them. Pretty sure we should be able to get them done. Exactly on the 28th. We'll see, I guess. Let's just go ahead and keep watering. There we go. Okay, so everything is good to go there. Um, We'll go ahead and put some stuff up if I can, maybe. I do want to go ahead and make a couple more iron bows. So let's go ahead and do that quickly, too. There we go. And that's the long thing. We'll put this stuff in here. Alright. We'll place some of this. I know who likes a frozen teal, so I might go see if I can find him. And then we'll just go ahead and place everything else up that we don't necessarily need. Um... Okay, so Haley is fully gifted out for the week, which is, you know, totally fine. But let's see if we can head down here, because I forgot to go ahead and check on... Ooh. Okay, so we have a crayfish, a piece of trash, and a snail. I like the snail. Big fan of having the snail. Uh, let's go ahead and we'll put this down here so I can go ahead and do a little bit more bait in here. But yeah, the snail will help me out when it comes to befriending, is it Vincent, I believe? Okay. See if I can just come down here for a second. And, alright, let's just see if we can run into the town here. Just because I find this to be faster for some reason. Um, there goes Sam. Can I see Vincent? Dang it. Okay, I'll talk to you quickly before you go ahead and hide in your room. I'll also talk to Jody. But I wanted to go ahead and see Vincent, but I can't get into his bedroom and he's in there playing. Okay, well, I guess I'm just going to go ahead and hoard the snail then. Um, Haley is out in the kitchen. Actually, she's kind of on the move a little bit. But let's just go ahead and talk to her. Because that will at least help out the heart level a little bit. It helps if you talk to everybody daily. I just never make it a huge priority for some reason. I don't know why. It's just never been something I've fully focused on. Did I already do the trash cans today? I don't remember. Okay, so Sebastian, which is who I want to go ahead and see is currently up at the mountain. I'm pretty sure I know exactly where he is. So we're just gonna go ahead and head up here. But we're gonna go ahead and give him the frozen tear that we have because they are one of his favorite gifts. And Sebastian was the first person I ever romanced in Stardew Valley. I don't know. I've always kind of had like a soft spot for like the emo guys. But we're gonna take that leak and then we'll come down here. Sebastian is currently, you know, having a smoke. You snuck into the caves last night with a crab. Okay. Well, I'll give you that. And then that should, you know, make us a little bit more friends than what we were. I don't entirely have anybody I would necessarily consider a friend in here. I don't consider them friends. Typically until, like, heart level four-ish. Linus, I didn't want anything from you. Um, okay, I only have some of his liked gifts. I don't feel like that's, like, worth any of my time to give him, though. Um, maybe I'll go ahead and just give you a horseradish. That's a good find. Yeah, you can have it. I want to level up with him because he gives a recipe, and I find it to be one that's actually very helpful. So let's just go ahead, we will run back through the back woods here, head back down to the farm, I'm going to take this leak, and we'll see, we might actually just go to bed. We don't have anything else that we necessarily need to do tonight, we will go ahead and grab those, and I think we're just going to go ahead and hop in and go to bed for the night. So let's go ahead and get some sleep. It's not going to be an absolutely fantastic money day, but some money is better than nothing, and I have to remember I did get some extra money from the fish as well. Alright, so it is now Friday morning. 
And we're going to come up here to say good morning to the sleepy cat, who's also going to get some water. And let's go ahead and just... I think we might actually start off with the chickens today. Because we are low on water anyway, so let's just go ahead and say good morning. While we grab some water and... Let's go ahead and head in here, grab some eggs. One, two. Okay. Perfect. So we'll go ahead and leave here and then we can come down and water everything. One, two, and then we'll water the parsnips that I have on some speed grow. I'm hoping that I plan that out okay, that it, you know, takes off like one day. I want to say that's what it does, but I don't fully remember for sure. I tend to be a little bit more efficient with my planting dates, but I forgot that the flower dance is the same day as the last technical like planting day for parsnips. So I did kind of mess that up for myself, but it's okay. Let's just go ahead and water. I think we are done. Everything has been watered. And we're going to go ahead and I'm just going to plant a bunch of seeds just kind of like randomly, which I know you're probably thinking like, why are you doing this? I want to be able to have some extra trees that I can just like chop down for wood whenever I want. So, there we go. Um, it looks like we have a periwinkle today, but I think I'm going to quickly run down here. And we're going to check the cart lady, see if she has anything good. We don't necessarily have a whole lot of money, so there's a good chance she could have something that I can't afford. But we can try. We've got a snail, egg, yam, dish of the sea, pomegranate, crystal fruit, weathered floor, glazed yam, sardine, lobster. Only thing of interest is the crystal fruit, but I can get that for free. So I'm not going to waste any of my money today on the cart lady, and instead we are going to go ahead and I think maybe head into the town again. So we're just going to head into the town. I want to check the trash cans, a broken CD, nothing all too important there. Um... Haley's currently in bed, so I can't do anything with her. So maybe we will go ahead and... I kind of want to check all the trash cans. I don't know. Let's come in here, actually. And we will go ahead and give a leak to George. Make him happy. This is my favorite thing, thank you. No problem. And then we'll come over here and say hello to Evelyn. Wish she'd go outside more. Well, okay, so I don't have anything she loves. So I'm not going to go ahead and give her anything right now. Um, oh, we got another book. Okay. So let's go ahead and we'll head over this way. Come up here. Okay, so we do have some iron that I'm going to go ahead and see if I can upgrade my axe. Oh, I don't have the money for that. Never mind. I do not have 5,000. I do have a crayfish that I can go ahead and sell. I don't need you for anything, though. So maybe we'll sell that with my eggs. Let's um, farm shipping bin. Okay, I'll go ahead and put my eggs in here too. And then we'll come over here to check the trash can. There was nothing. Okay. Okay, nothing in that one either. So let's just go ahead. We'll head up here and take a look and see if there's anything in the Joja trash can too. Which it doesn't appear that there is. But we did just get some daffodils, so that's always nice. I think I have... Okay. I didn't have a gold one prior. That's fine. We can just go ahead and keep that one on us for right now. Looks like we have another help wanted. Green algae to rub on my calves. Do I don't have one. I honestly thought I would have kept one. I'm kind of surprised that I didn't. But we're going to head over this way, back towards the farm. Um, 
I kind of want to go ahead and get this spot, so don't mind me. Oh, we got some clay out of that. Is there anything? I'll take this leek. Oh, it looks like we also have a dandelion. Okay. I'm trying to just kind of, like, keep as many things as I can while also getting my foraging skill up. Now... What do I want to go ahead and do? I'll go ahead and put some stuff up here. I need to go ahead and make another chest. We're kind of running out of space. I could plant the peach sapling. So maybe we'll do that. Um, let's just go ahead and put the peach sapling, like, right there. Because it bears fruit in the summer anyways. And we have another giant painting. Now, here's the thing. I don't think I have anywhere I can put this one until I have more space. So I'm going to put that up in the inventory. We have the mountain thing that I'm going to go ahead and use. So we'll just go ahead and warp up here. Look at little Linus. I love him. We'll talk to you. Don't destroy your tent. It's happened before. I would never. I'm going to go ahead and give you this leak. And then we can go ahead head over this way and I think we're gonna go ahead and go mining for a little bit I think that's a good way to kind of spend the day um I want to go ahead we'll start over here at level 40 okay let's just go ahead and mine a bit looks like the only thing we have in here is a couple of slimes which I'm not all you know too worried about I forgot that we have the bug head though now I don't know, I don't typically use the bug head a whole lot. I normally hold out for something else. But I know like it's a pretty good one to have that's free. So let's just go ahead and see if we can mine a little bit. I want to see if I can get anything that I need for the winter foraging bundle. That's kind of like my main priority right now. So let's just go ahead and go down the ladder. It looks like we have a dust sprite, which I'm just going to go ahead and try and get you now. A bandana shirt. Interesting. I'm going to put that in here. And we do have some island spots, but I am going to go ahead and see if I can get these slimes first. Okay. Um, this one moved up here. Okay, so now I can just kind of like peacefully mine a little bit more. Other than the fact that we have a bat coming this way too. So let's just go ahead and get you. Thankfully, the bug head works pretty quickly on bats, which I am very happy about. So let's just go ahead, see how much iron ore I can get. I do need more money. Oh no, okay. I did not switch my tool over fast enough. So we did just take a little bit of damage from the bat, but that's okay. Now we have gotten rid of it and we can just continue to mine just a little. But yeah, I'm kind of just focusing seeing if i can get anything i need for the winter foraging bundle because i would love to be able to get some of that done sooner than later because i believe i can get everything i need from these like colder mine levels we'll get this bat but yeah i'm pretty sure i can i might have to do a little bit of a google after i finish this part but I'm almost certain that I can get everything I need for the winter foraging bundle in these levels of the mines. So I'm going to quickly switch this over to the farm again. And we're going to go ahead and just throw some stuff up here and make a little bit of space. I'm going to take the cave carrots. We'll put the stuff away. That was not how I want this to be set up. Move this here. Put this up here. Move this down here this up here, put this down here, move it this up here. So I want to have access to some food. So let's just go ahead and eat that. That was not a whole lot of energy, but that's okay. So, um, the cave carrots are slightly better. And I believe I already donated one, so I don't even have to worry about that. We also have cookies, which I forgot about. So let's just go ahead and eat those. There we go. Cookies are a very good energy boost. Health I'm not worried about. It's pretty decent right now. So we'll just go ahead and keep 
mining, see what we can find. I do see that we have a frozen tier down here, which I will be taking. I also might take that quartz as well. But for right now, I'm just going to kind of like, I find mining in these parts a little bit more relaxing. I'm not as stressed when it comes to like the snow level mines for some reason. I have no idea why. But we did just get another bat, which also dropped a bomb with it. And then we'll go ahead and get this little slime guy over here too. They all seem to drop sap lately, and I don't remember if that's normal. But I feel like they all drop like a lot of sap. I kind of want to use the bomb, but I don't think this is like a great spot for it. Actually, this might be. This might be a decent spot. There we go. So we can just run around, collect all of those resources, and we can head down the ladder. So I already see that we have a death spray over there, which, you know, not a big concern to me. The death sprites are pretty easy to fight off, at least. And hopefully they at least give us some coal. I would love that. But let's just go ahead and keep this going. We did just find the ladder. But I do want to try to use my stuff that I can, you know, get as many monsters as possible. We did just get a crystal fruit. Perfect. I had the chance to buy that at the cart and I didn't. So that worked out quite nicely for me. So now we just need a crocus and a snow yam, I believe. Which is not too bad. I know how to get the snow yam. It's the crocus. I'm unsure about and if it's available here. But let's just go ahead and get all of these little dust plates. Why are you like over in such a weird spot? There we go. So you just at least dropped some coal. But let's go ahead. It doesn't look like there's any other monsters. Oh, there's a bat. Okay, we'll get that too. So I think we're gonna actually head up here and mine up here just because there's more nodes and I'm thinking we probably have a better chance of finding one of the ladders up here. Not saying it's for sure, but at least this way we can also go ahead and just gather some resources, but there we go. Okay, so it looks like we have a slime, so we're going to go ahead and fight you off. Oh, there's two of them. Okay, fight both of you off then. Um, caveman shirt. Okay. Apparently there's a lot of, like, clothing drops with like slime and stuff like that now, but let's just go ahead and keep mining. But yeah, I feel like I'm getting a lot more clothing than I normally do. I don't know. I do have like the caveman outfit in my own personal save and I think it's the cutest thing. I love wearing it around. I don't use it as like an everyday thing, but for like, um, Spirit's Eve, is that what it's called? The Halloween event? I use it very quite often. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take my hoe and we're going to go ahead and hoe up this spot. Um, because we have a chance, I believe, of getting a snow yam here. I need to go ahead and eat this leek. The only thing I don't want to eat is the crystal fruit. Because I need that for a bundle. So let me just go ahead and eat a couple of cave carrots as well. And then we'll just go ahead and keep hoeing. But yeah, so I believe I can go ahead and get a snow yam here. Um, also just gave me a free cave carrot, which I will never be mad about. But I'm pretty sure they are available here. So any sort of patch like this, you will probably see me using my hoe on. Just because I want to see if I can get it a little bit faster. So we will just go ahead and keep mining see what we can do. I'm hoping I can kind of squeeze past these bigger ones up here. Now we do have a bat that I need to go ahead and get. So let's go ahead and focus on you a little bit. There we go. And honestly not too bad. We have another patch over here that we can also go ahead and hoe. But I'm going to go ahead and try to get rid of this slime guy first. There we go. Perfect. And then we can just go ahead and do the same thing right here. See if we can possibly dig up a snow yam. I'm hoping I'm right about this. I know I can also get some cool like artifacts and stuff. And some clay, which is always nice. I will also take that. But I'm pretty sure snow yams are available in the mines. If they're not, 
then I am completely wrong and I feel bad about it, but um, we are like running out of energy, so I think we're going to have to go ahead and leave the mines because I don't want to like waste all of my cave kits on nothing. So I think we're going to go ahead and head home for the night. But, like, we managed to still get some pretty decent stuff. I might see if I can actually quickly get to the community center just to put this crystal fruit in so that I don't accidentally sell it. Oh. Uh, I don't really know you. Yeah, I know that. But I'm gonna go ahead and give you the frozen tea anyways. Cool. Alright, well, he loves that. We got him a gift. And I don't have any need for it, so I may as well use it to build up relationships. But let's go ahead and hop in here to the community center. And I think it's over here. This is one of those times that I don't fully know, like, where everything is located. But we'll go ahead and put that there. Okay. Um, is there anything else? I'm going to put this away. I don't think I have anything else other than maybe that aquamarine. That might be the only other thing I need to go ahead and throw in. And I think I've unlocked where the aquamarine needs to go. Let me just like double check something. Okay. I apparently have two crystal fruits. But I think the aquamarine is the dye bundle for Emily. I think. Okay, let me just throw this here. And I don't think I have anything else. I'm just going to go ahead and use my farm warp totem though. Um, actually, you know what? No, I can't. I'm going to have to run home because I haven't cleared out the spot for the warp totem, which would mean that we get stuck. So I definitely don't want to do that. Although that could probably make for a really funny short if I was to do that. But... I definitely need to kind of like focus on clearing out that spot because if I was to like actually use my warp totem right now, I would be stuck behind like a bunch of trees and rocks. But let's just go ahead and head to here, go to sleep for the night. And I think this is going to be where we wrap up for today. So if you enjoyed this video, you can go ahead and hit the like button down below. If you want to see some more videos from me, you can go ahead and subscribe. I post videos typically three to four times a week right now. If you are already subscribed and want notifications for it when I post, hit that bell down below. If you want exclusive perks to the channel, hit that join button down below beside the subscribe button as well. And I will see you all next time. Bye lovelies!